Hi everyone, I hope you all are doing great in your life. So in this video, I'll tell you the top 5 resources that are required to become a data analyst in 2023. And I'll share the free resources for such skills in this video. And the resources will be linked in the description box below. And I'll also share the salary range for such skills. So even if you have acquired just one skill that is required to become a data analyst, you will have a chance to grab a job offer for that as well. So please stay tuned. So before we go on in this video, I would just like to mention that you need to be really, really good at mathematics. So when I mention mathematics, it does not mean that you need to learn whole calculus or algebra. You just need to be good at statistics and probability because that much is required. So when you are uh, like uh, working as a data analyst, you need to work on certain formulas. You mentioned some formulas in your Excel sheet or spreadsheet. So there you require certain level of like knowledge over these subjects learn statistics and probability you probably have to go to your 11th and 12th book and start solving those questions and if you cannot find your 11th and 12th book now or if you not if you have not opted for mathematics in your 11th and 12th so i will share a video link in the description box below you can le start learning from those and practice the questions that are there on the google and one more thing that you will require is the knowledge of domain. So for example, I'm working in e-com domain, I've worked in CRM domain as well. So I need to have the knowledge over such domains. So if you are healthcare data analyst, you need to have uh, knowledge in healthcare. So that's the thing that is required. And if you are not experienced in domain, so that no, you don't need to worry. That is the thing that comes with experience. So once you are like working in a project, so you will gain the experience in this particular domain and that much is required. <clears throat> All right, without wasting any more time, we can go to my computer screen and check the top five skills that are required to become a data analyst. So now let's open data nerd.tech. I'm going to mention here the job title and select the country if I want to. So I'm going to be choosing India as my country. So now I'm going to check all the skills that are essential. So here I see SQL, Python, Excel, Tableau and Power BI are the top 5 skills that are required to become a data analyst in 2023. So now I'm going to move to skill pay ranges. And here as well I will select the job title as data analyst. And now you can see the uh, skills are listed and the pay range for them as well listed so if you know one skill such as tableau so you will be paid this much for this skill so now that we know that the top five skills required to become a data analyst are sql excel python power bi and tableau now the question arises where i can learn these skills for free so i'm going to mention all the resources in the description box below that too are free and that will develop a great level of proficiency in those skills so yeah you might want to go in the description box below and check those skills out so firstly the first two skills are uh, sql and excel and i have created a dedicated video for both of the skills and wherein i mention all the free resources and all the techniques that are that are used to learn those skills so you can check those videos as well otherwise i'm going to mention the links to the free resources in the in the description box below so yeah all right next up we have is python so learning python was a bit difficult journey for me because i was from a non-it background and i didn't have any prior knowledge of coding before that and that seemed pretty scary to me but then i wanted to start very easy so i chose to watch the playlist of code with harry python and those videos are like four five minutes of videos and the videos are very easy so once you're a beginner you need to go through those videos and then you can practice the exercises that are available on w3 schools and that too are very easy exercises so that kind of built my flow and then i uh, watch all of the videos 100 and 200 videos are there for uh, in the same playlist so i watch all of the videos and then i practiced the exercises from w3 schools those were very easy then i practiced all of that then i went to like explore more into python then i searched for hacker earth so and hacker rank as well so i've uh, practiced all of the exercises that were there for the easy ones that, that were there in the hacker earth and hacker rank so i practiced all of that then i also practiced the exercises that were available on, on geeks for geeks so that kind of uh, made me a little bit confident over python but then uh, that was also not sufficient and I've uh, practiced a project uh, that was present on Kaggle website. 
so that's how i have built the proficiency in python and all of the resource links are uh, present in the description box below moving on to the next thing that is tableau and python so tableau is something that i've learned from uh, learn free from udemy because there was a course in udemy uh, which mentioned the data science course that i bought for like 500 rupees but then to complete the course uh, 50% completion of the course uh, they have gifted me the tableau course so that's the thing uh, that was a 8 hour course that that i've gone through on udemy but uh, there is a video in the youtube uh, which is created by pawan lalwani uh, for tableau and power bi as well so i have gone through that video as well so that video contained everything that you have, that you will require to learn tableau and power bi so i'm going to link those video in the description box below and you can go through such videos for power bi and tableau so once you are like uh, once you've gone through those videos you what you can do is uh, open those websites that are uh, like power bi and tableau and those are the open source websites so anyone can practice for free so what you can do is learn uh, learn the skills from those videos and practice it on the website so that kind of build your uh, like confidence in power bi and tableau so that that is the thing that uh, pretty much sums about uh, my journey in uh, data analysis so yeah if you have followed all the steps given in this video i'm sure you're going to become a data analyst very soon obviously it depends on the individual how fast you learn it but then uh, if you follow certain structure if you start from very easy then you go to easy then you go to medium level uh, problems then you go to tougher ones then i'm sure you will learn any skills that is there in this world because that kind of build your confidence in the uh, particular skill so that is my funder to learn anything in life and i hope you guys like this video if you have liked this video please share it with your friends who need it thank you very much for watching my video